People often confuse SIS panels and SIP walls thinking they are the same thing, but this is not the case. A SIP wall is the entire wall including the frame, while an SIS panel is just the exterior sheathing that is installed on an already existing frame. SIS panels are a raw material meaning you can purchase individual panels from lumberyards slash suppliers, cut the panels to size, and install them as if they were regular sheathing. The finished wall is no different than what tradespeople are used to when it comes to utility installation. SIP walls are prefabricated walls meaning that SIP is designed with wiring, piping, sockets, studding, etc. in mind increasing the complexity of the utility and wall installation. Not only does this mean there is less room for error, but it increases the difficulty for tradespeople to work with them. More specifically, with SIS panels, the placement of the utilities in the wall remains unchanged, allowing similar access for inspections, repairs, and renovations. With SIP walls, the utilities need to be run through the foam, which makes inspections, repairs, and renovations difficult as accessibility and visibility are restricted. All components within an SIS panel are customizable, allowing for different material based on your construction needs, such as non-combustibility, water-resistant barriers, and air barriers. For example, some board options include DENS glass, FRCC slash MGO board, or fire rated OSB. These are only a few of the possible combinations with SIS panels, not to mention the customizable core options for greater R values. With a SIP wall, there has been little to no attempts to diversify the components used. The majority of SIP walls are manufactured with OSB boards and EPS foam, which means fire retardant wraps and other steps are still required. SIS panels come with both structural and non-structural options. Structural panels can be installed at any height on a building. A non-structural panel can be installed up to six stories high. SIP walls have rarely been used in construction projects over four stories. Most SIS panel options will protect your building in the event of a fire, allowing for occupants to escape safely and prevent the spread of the fire. After the fire is put out, the structure of the building is likely intact, which means that the only thing that needs to be replaced is the damaged panels. Conversely, if a SIP wall is damaged, the whole wall will need to be replaced. Overall, SIS panels are a cost-effective and highly efficient solution to wall construction making any construction project safer both during and after construction, keeping your tradespeople happy by not complicating their work, and taking advantage of a wide range of materials available. SAS panels, better, faster, easier.